Good morning there, Murray's readers and leaders. Arthur Roy Murray here for Books for the Inquisitive Mind. I got one for you, you smart people. If you're an inquisitive mind, you're here. Do you believe in magic? Well, I finished a book last night about magic. It was called The Paper Magician by Ms. Hoglum. The information is down below on where you can get the book. Uh, I must say I didn't really enjoy the book. I enjoyed the pace of it. Okay, it moved right along. It's a story about someone who I call Chloe, but it's C-E-O-N-Y is her name. Uh, she becomes an apprentice to a paper magician she doesn't want to be there but because of the protocol of the school and whatever she has to be there and like alice in wonderland this is not alice in wonderland it's a fantasy she falls into the heart of the paper magician after a few days of being his apprentice, he goes off, he comes back, and all hell breaks out. And then Chloe falls into the heart of the paper musician. There are some things going on here where she learns how to make animals from paper, uh, this thing to ward off that spell and this spell, and she learns. But the crux of the story is her in his heart. And we find out what her endeavors were, her life, and basically his life. And as I mentioned a little while ago, it's a fast pace. It gets a little confusing. You've got to be on your toes. You've got to be, uh, your inquisitive mind has to be clicking to pick up all the little stories that are going on here. Uh, it's a character developer. It's the first in a series. Uh, I wouldn't say it's the best first in a series I've read, but it she did her job well chloe is in the heart of the paper magician uh i'm not going to go ahead and read any more of the series but if you're into magic this does have that fantasy alice in wonderland type of thing and if you liked alice in wonderland you would like this uh i'm not uh it gets a little uh mind playing uh the writing is well done um uh i didn't give it too many stars uh maybe you would i mean 50 percent, roughly 50 percent of the people that read her book on amazon and she had a lot of people read it I think 5,000 people read this book or more. So she's well known. Uh, I'll leave it at that. Uh, I can't say anything more about the book. It was, it was like that. It was over with. But I had to really put my thinking cap on. And so if you want a book that you get your thinking cap on, and it, it's a little bit of a love story too i mean she's in his heart she goes through his heart and all the doors and she's being chased by the his nemesis which i won't get into because that uh, gives out the whole story ah uh, but if you're like i said if you're into magic this will do it for you have a good day uh this is arthur roy murray oh subscribe as i said i'm an eclectic writer i never read a book about magicians 
but here I have. Uh, I might go back and see something in another writer on magic. However, this one just didn't float my boat. It might for you people that like fantasy and you like magic. See you later, alligator. Arthur Roy Murray. Remember, subscribe, hit the bell. Bye.